In this problem, we are being given coordinates for a rectangle. And we're being asked to determine what its perimeter and what its area is. Now you could just plot this in the coordinate plane. You could go ahead and map it out. And I'm just going to make a, a sketch about this just so it, it'll help us think about it. So 5, 0 is one of the vertices. So that would be, let's say here, let's say this is 5, 0. Negative 4, 0 is one of the vertices. So that would be over here. And then um, negative, sorry, uh, negative 4, negative 5 down here and 5, negative 5 down here. So we do have a rectangle. And what we need to know is you know, how far apart the, uh, these sides are. Uh, so the difference basically in the x uh, uh, coordinates and then the difference in the y. That's going to give us the length and the width. So in this case, we were at 5, 0 and negative 4, 0. So this is a distance then, or a length of 9. And then we're at uh, 5, 0 up here and 5, negative 5 down here. So this is a distance of 5. So we've got a rectangle that is 9 by 5. So you can sketch that out to make that more obvious to you, or you can just look at the difference in the x-coordinates and the difference in the y-coordinates and get those two dimensions. But in any case, we have a, a 9 by 5 rectangle. So our area is going to be 9 times 5. And that is 45 square units. Our perimeter is going to be two lengths and two widths. So it's going to be 9 plus 9 plus 5 plus 5. So it's 18 plus 10 or 28 units. So that's how to find the perimeter or the area of a rectangle when you're just given the coordinates.